Now, I didn't get a chance to talk with Rodrigo between rounds, but I, I, I'm thinking he's, I, I'm hoping he's thinking six from one to two. But you've got to take a good gallop to the first jump to do the six. Yeah, there's not a lot of places on course where you can really make a big difference in your jump off time. It, there's certainly no... He's doing six. No, nope. oh, no, he jumped in like he was doing six, and then he pulled on the reins halfway. This was tight. much tighter here. That was tight. Yeah, that was tight. And this, and is, this very is tighter. Tight. And found it coming forward. Wow. Had a rub at B, but it just He's blazing instant. fast. He needs to just cool it a bit. Holy moly. On the gas. We're not even near the ring, and we can hear the screaming. If he can leave this jump up, I don't think they're going to catch him. Yep. 38. I'm going to say 39 52. 39. 39. I'm, I'm going to say that's the winner. I, I just don't see how. I mean, to beat him, they, they really got to go. Rodrigo didn't leave. I don't know. He didn't leave a crack in the door. He was tight back on the oxer. I mean, the only way to beat him is. He got lucky with the hard yeah, rub. Do everything he did. And, and do six, six strides from one to two. That was unbelievable. But we've got some fast riders coming up. We've got uh, Margie can be pretty fast. Kent, who won the other day, could be extremely fast.